Hello everyone, welcome to NASA's app. Today we will introduce the QDA series as a range of drive adapters that provide users with the ability to install various drives into their PC or workstation, say Windows or Linux, or QNAP NAS to meet various storage needs. Here we have from left to right the QDA A2AR, QDA A2MAR, QDA UMP, QDA U2MP, and, uh, Q and these uh, are the four adapters on today's session. As you can see, the first two are going one by one. So moving on with the first one, the QDA A2AR drive adapter, which accommodates two 2.5-inch SATA drives with a 3.5-inch SATA drive bay with up to 6 gigabit per second uh, file transfer speeds, which supports hardware RAID and provides a disk mode switch tool for selecting RAID nodes. So QDA A2M AR drive adapter also accommodates two M.2 SATA SSDs within a 2.5 inch SATA drive bay with up to 6 gigabit second file transfer speed. Similarly, supports hardware RAID and provides a disk mode switch tool for selecting the RAID modes and has a high quality metal construction which assists in dissipating heat from the M.2 SSDs to ensure high performance. So the QDA UMP drive adapter is uh, the other version that accommodates the M.2 PCIe NVMe SSD with a 2.5 inch U.2 SSD drive bay with up to PCIe generation 3x4 fast transfer speeds similarly as the previous the aluminum uh, alloy top and bottom frame assists in dissipating heat from the M.2 SSD to ensure high performance. And we have the QDIU 2 MP, similar as the previous one, but this time it accommodates two M.2 PCIe NVMe SSDs, generation 3x4. However, all these disks are constructed in a high quality metal for heat dissipation and M.2 SSD thermal pad for heat induction for cooler SSDs. Moreover, they are equipped with a RAID controller for a more efficient use of the disk and also based on purpose or preference on RAID settings from individual RAID 1, RAID 0 or for JBAR. And there is the disk mode switch tool that is packed with it manually to control the RAID switch to create or delete a RAID mode whereas it takes only a few steps to switch the disk mode on a PC first by switching to individual mode first say port multiplier mode then connect QDA to the SATA data and power ports after 10 seconds remove the QDA switch to another disk mode say RAID 1, RAID 0 or JBOT and lastly connect the QDA to the SATA data and uh, power ports so similarly you follow the same procedure to do so on an NAS by switching to individual mode first, inserting in the tray, wait for 10 seconds, remove after sw uh, which switch to another disk mode and connect it again to keep it running. So this is NAS ASAP with the QDA drive adapter series and I'll see you next time. Bye.